Simon, a big test on Saturday with Italy coming to the Aviva Stadium. Can you talk us through a little bit about the challenge of the of picking apart the Italian backline? Yeah, it's going to be tough. You know, they've got some uh, proven test players and test starters in their squad, and you know the likes of Campagnaro, who's an exciting 13 uh, game breaker. Uh, Leonardo Sarto, Odiette, these guys have got real wheels and, and will pose a threat to us and they're going to be dangerous so I think if we can nullify those guys um, then we'll, we'll create a good platform for us going forward. It's a game that, that, that rugby fans often think we should win because we should be stronger than Italy but it's not a game that you take for granted at all is it? Yeah definitely not, you don't want to be the side that comes out and loses and everybody's expecting you to win so you know we're af off the back of, of two uh, defeats and a draw which isn't um, the meeting the standards that we'd set as a, as a squad so um, we want to go out and right the wrongs this weekend and uh, hopefully pick up the win. When you say it's not meeting the standards, how, how does that manifest itself then in camp? Does that make you work harder, train harder, or do you do you look at everything that you're doing? Yeah, it makes you, it gives you that little extra edge. You know, I, I think the performances aren't reflecting the talent we have in in the squad, and um, I just think we need to uh, just concentrate on being more clinical in the opposition's 22 and getting those scores off the breaks that we're making, and um, we'll we'll be going alright. Simon, best of luck at the weekend.